of a remarkable win against the tough Ravens team. The Browns tonight dedicating the win to our own Jim Donovan. Good evening, I'm Lena Lai. Tonight, cheers among the tears at Huntington Bank Field today. The Ravens came to town with a lot of confidence over a one in six Browns team, which along with us are mourning the death of longtime voice of the Browns, Jim Donovan, who passed away yesterday morning. Oh, how Jimmy would have loved the down to the wire win. Our Nick Camino is here now and Nick, so many inexplicable things oh. happening in the Browns favor today. I mean, it really is easy to believe that it was divine intervention. Lena, I mean, there's no other way to explain <laughs> this other than Jim Donovan. I mean, what a day down at the stadium today. All of us remembering Jim Donovan, Browns fans, Cleveland sports fans, all of us here at Channel 3, an emotional day down at the stadium. And the tributes were pouring in all throughout the day. The Browns did a great job of honoring Jim in a lot of ways, including photos of him in the press box and the Browns radio booth. Jimmy, the voice of the Browns since they came back in 1999. He definitely played a part in this one. What a day. And it didn't stop just after the win. After the victory, Browns head coach Kevin Stefanski giving the Donovan's family a game ball. And look at this. They were at his house just moments ago. You have uh, Kevin Stefanski there and Andrew Barry hand delivering a game ball to Cheryl and Megan at their home. And Stefanski walked in the door and said, we did this today. We won this game today because of Jim. And this was Stefanski in the locker room after the win. I told you guys I would love nothing more than to give this game ball to the family, to the family of Jim Donovan. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Jim loved the Cleveland Browns. He loved you guys. Okay, we love him back. We will be there for his family. This one's for Jim. Yes, Team on three. One, two, three.